Well, Nikki, just imagine your medical student debt being completely taken care of. Congressman Josh Harder says low repayment programs like this have existed in 48 other states for over a decade. But now medically underserved regions in Texas and California, like the San Joaquin Valley, have this drop for doctors. It's just, I mean, it's unheard of. From Stockton. One of my patients had a stroke in November. And so she was discharged from the hospital and she still hasn't seen a neurologist because of issues with her health insurance and finding providers that would take it. To Modesto. Half of the OBs in town that were practicing prior to the pandemic are no longer practicing. So we're left with more women who need care and half the number of physicians out there who can provide the care. Dr. Robert Altman says seeing a doctor in a timely manner has been a challenge for a lot of Central Valley patients post pandemic from specialty to primary care. What's always been difficult for the Valley is competing for docs. Dr. June Liu says a part of the reason a lot of patients in the area use Medicare and Medi-Cal insurance programs with lower paying claims. So I still have my loans and I graduated medical school 20 years ago. One of my friends who's in a major metropolitan area, she's paid off her uh, loans well over 10 years ago. Representative Josh Harder says a public service loan forgiveness program available for the first time to physicians in California and Texas could change things. This program is very simple. It creates a loan repayment program for every physician coming to an underserved part of California. It's estimated to bring 10,000 doctors to our region over the next couple of years, and frankly, they can't get here soon enough. Doctors who spend 30 hours a week working at a Department of Education approved nonprofit or public hospital for 10 years can qualify. Dr. Lou says he's excited to apply and sees this helping many other physicians too. I know of medical students that have like well over half a million dollars in debt. So this will provide a relief. Harder is hoping the next step is a medical school in Central Valley. It's outrageous that we have 6 million people from Stockton to Bakersfield and we do not have our very own high caliber medical school. And so if we can actually create that pipeline, I think it's going to be uh, very virtuous. And applications for this loan repayment program are now available. And as mentioned, there are certain criteria you have to meet to qualify. That information can be found on our website, fox40.com. Nikki.